Terra Hybrid Begonias. I have about 3,000 or so left to go around. Today you're getting them at this featured price, along with the free shipping, along with the four pay easy pay plan, and you are also getting a full 10 ounce bottle of your Flower Magic fertilizer, which by itself is normally $19? $19.98. So um, guess what? You're getting an incredible offer here. You're getting seven of these begonias that are not the itty bitty begonias that you're used to seeing in the grocery store that maybe you pick up for mom and give to her for Mother's Day. These size blooms that you're seeing here are the size that these begonias become. So I'm gonna introduce you to Court Walleen from the Walleen family, carrying on many generations of great flower growing and expertise. Hello, Jill. Nice to see nice you. To see you. Always too. a pleasure. Hello, hello. These begonias are kind of your specialty too. I love begonias yeah. and I think because it's so near and dear to my heart because it was so near and dear to my mom's heart. Yeah. It was the last flower that my mom, Roberta, uh, asked us to be sure to plant. Uh, out the kitchen windows so she could see them planted underneath the maple tree that we have growing there. And that's important to note, under a tree. These are shade loving flowers that's that right, give Jill. you big bold color in those areas where you may have thought I can only do hostas. That's right. Now it's time to jazz it up with some begonias. Jazz it up is right and what we're looking at here Jill is a typical Dutch begonia with its itty bitty little one or two inch flowers. Right. We love them, we buy yes. them, we, they die, we throw them away and we buy again but this <laughs> is the American hybrid uh, Dutch uh, begonia that started from the Dutch but it's, now it's been growing by one family farm in Northern California for over 80 years they started with this and this is what they become these are giant memorable powder puffs of color in the shade July August, September, every year, year after year, if you want to raise them and bring them in, and you can start new plants. It's a seven piece set, Jill. Yes. And it comes. So does that mean I'm getting seven bulbs? You're getting seven mm -hmm. of the bulbs, along with the full size bottle of our Hawaiian Flower Magic 9. 18.9. This is great on all of your plants. It's the only collection that we offer this year yeah. with this full size bottle. Love it. Can so, these go in containers, Court? They're beautiful in containers. Okay. And I'd love to show you how fun and easy they are to plant. Okay, let's show everybody. Shall we do Roberta's bulb soak? Let's do it. Could a I soak. ask you? Yes. Okay. So, what you're going to do, Jill, is I recommend getting a little bowl of water and putting a couple of drops of this the is flower like a magic. spa treatment for your flowers. You're right. All right? A spa treatment. <laughs> Who couldn't well, use that? A couple of drops in here. It's like a, a shot of espresso in the morning. It really wakes them up. But then you uh, are going to soak your bulbs and you're going to do this overnight, Jill. Okay. And then in the morning, what you're going to do is you're going to plant them. And I promise you, no back-breaking effort. Okay, good. So if you have poor knees, like I'm beginning to show the yes. signs of, uh, if you're new to gardening, you can't grow wrong with this. Good one for kids to, yes. to grow. So what you're going to do is after your bulbs have soaked, is you just lay them on top of the ground or a container of soil. Yes, to okay. To your point. I love them in containers. I love these uh, on a shady porch. How many would you put in a container of well, like this size? This is a 12 inch container. You could put two. Okay. If you want to do uh, one in an eight inch container, very well. Okay. So I then cover them with just a half inch That's it. of the potty mix. You notice I didn't even have to dig a hole. No, you didn't even use a garden tool. Not at all. No. I, uh, Waterman used the Flower Magic, which again makes 125 gallons. That's 500 quarts. It comes with it. And that's included. Yeah, it's included. love that. And then you'll start to see these incredible, gigantic, I mean, some of these blooms are so huge and they're so multi-petaled. Yes. And there's, and, and I guess, is it sort of a random mix that you'll receive? It is, it's a random mix. Yeah, so you'll get different types of colors and, um, and highs and almost tie-dye looks. Yes, you know, right? in the industry that's called Pika tea. that mm -hmm. means it's a solid color bordered with a, a secondary color, which I love that tangerine orange oh, with the I love that one, white right? edges and the yellow center in and then, there. Then and that look was at this a, one. Yes, oh. that's another Pika tea. It's a Pika tea pink with creamy white petals edged in that beautiful pink. Oh, that's gorgeous. Mother Nature at her best. And what we're looking at now is the are the fields in Northern California. Wow. And they're all harvested, tumbled together. This is a great assortment. Is this the 
collection that you were telling me mm -hmm. that the family yeah. um, is years. retiring. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad you mentioned that because yeah. I want to say hi to you guys. It's been great working with you and growing with you, but the family is retiring. There's no uh, generation to come after them. Oh, so wow. this is the last year that we'll be able to offer these giant oh, American begonias from them. Oh my gosh, you guys, so get them. them. So tell everybody, Court, if I live in a warm climate where there's no frost, can I plant these in the ground or plant them as a pot and then just leave them be? Yes, you can. If I live here in Philadelphia or climates where there is going to be a freeze, yes. what do I do so that I can turn what many people might think of as an annual, how do I turn it into a Yeah, you a winterize perennial? it, yes, yes, and you get a big head start on the next season. So what do so I do? So this is what you're planting and this is what you dig up at the end of the season. Wow. You pull those out and remember, they're just under the ground a half inch, so it's really easy. Store these in a brown paper bag. In the garage? And, or? In the garage, okay. uh, in the basement, anywhere, it doesn't matter, wherever it doesn't freeze. And the next year you get uh, a, a, a wow. jump on your, on your game here. And they're gonna spread and they're gonna multiply. And this is a beautiful representation of what you're gonna get on uh, my bench from Jeff Myers, the folded bench. <laughs> I love displaying my plants on, by the way. Remember, you're getting seven of the bulbs, seven bulbs. and the large 10 ounce bottle full size of your Flower Magic Fertilizer. We started the garden season with over 20,000 sets. We now have fewer than 2,800 to go around. That's it for the whole so, season. And that's it for the season. It may be it for a long time until you can find another breeder who raises these. And if they, they will have to come from uh, the Netherlands and they won't be at this price. Yeah. You know, I did the simple math. They're just under $2 per bulb. Yeah. And so pick up several sets, stock up on your plant food. And if you have a shady garden, Jill, you'll have uh, a garden that will put to envy anybody with a sunny garden because this is more beautiful than and, uh, a postcard. It's so showy. And easy. It's so showy and so easy. And here's the zone map. So these will, a lot of you will get your plants and flowers like immediately. Right away. Some of you in the far north, um, maybe not until the first or second week of May. You're right. And, and then you, what about the guarantee? Well, we have a gotta grow guarantee, Jill. When you're happy, we're happy. And Roberta is going to assure your satisfaction for its perennials 